Hello everyone, my name is Iris France, which I Wan Ru. Today we are going to talk about the difference of Lavender expression between constraint maximization and constraint minimization. So typically when you are setting Lagrangian, that's because you're trying to maximize or minimize something. But the issue will arise, you will think, hmm, do I put a plus or minus sign in front of my Lagrangian multiplier? In this case it's lambda. So here I'm going to give you a bottom line. When you are trying to maximize something, you put a plus sign in front of your Lagrangian multiplier. If you're doing minimization, then you put a minus sign in front of your Lagrangian multiplier. And inside the bracket of your constraint, always put the thing that is large at the left-hand side. So what does that mean? Let's first take a look at the example of utility maximization. So we're trying to maximize our utility. So this is a cop Douglas utility subject to our budget constraint. So when you set up Lagrangian, you put utility function in front. That's the thing you're trying to optimize. Plus your Lagrangian multiplier. Notice it's plus because we're trying to maximize. Your Lagrangian multiplier times your budget constraint. So in your budget constraint, you know that your purchase, PSX plus PYY, must be less than or equal to your budget. So your budget is supposed to be greater, the bigger side, on the left hand side. So your budget I minus PXX minus PYY. So that's how you set up your Lagrangian when you're trying to maximize your utility. And moving on to our cost minimization, when you're trying to minimize your cost, typically is the constraint is here. Your output, after you apply your capital and your labor, has to be greater than or equal to a certain quantity, Q0. So Q0 is a number, it could be 10 or 100, something like that. And what you're trying to minimize is the cost. There will be R, that's the cost of capital, R times K, plus wage, W times L. And that's the thing you are trying to minimize. So you put the thing you try to minimize here. And now since we're trying to minimize the cost, you should put minus your Lagrangian multiplier lambda times the constraint. So your constraint tells you that my output has to be greater than or equal to a certain quantity. So you know this output is bigger. You put output on the left hand side. So that's the difference between utility maximization and cost minimization. That's how you set up your Lagrangian in the future. I hope you don't get confused about hmm, should I do plus lambda or minus lambda. That depends on whether you're trying to maximize or minimize. I hope this helps. We'll see you next time.